Every week we highlight a story from CBS Village, our series that gives voice to all communities. And today we are headed to Baltimore, just in time for Earth Day, introducing you to some engineering students who are working on projects to help save the planet. Dennis Valera from CBS News Baltimore has a story. You're looking at a wind turbine built by a group of Mervo engineering students. One of the projects that earned them first, second, and third place, a podium sweep at the regional kid win competition at the University of Maryland in March. I'm just really, really excited. I'm really happy for everybody how we all got first, second, and third, and we all get to go to Arizona. The competition tasked teams to build wind turbines, assessing their designs, presentation, and engineering capabilities. For a lot of the team, an interest in engineering started early. It came from a lot of, I guess, tinkering, like a lot of inventing, as my parents would say. And um, I guess I ended up like deconstructing like a whole lot of my toys when I was a kid. I always liked robots um, at a young age and I always like building things. All, all the cool robot movies, you know, Chappie, iRobot, Real Steel, they all made me want to like, man, I think I could build that. While this is Mervo's third year in a row sweeping the podium, the team still accomplished a new first. We won the instant challenge. We did amazing on our presentation and we um, got the highest in our division, which led to a perfect score, which was the first time that happened in Maryland, apparently, for the 12 years that they've been having this um, competition. The students range from sophomores to seniors, and to build for competition, it takes a lot of collaboration, sharpening skills they'll be taking beyond Mervo's halls. We all think differently. Um, I wouldn't knock on anybody else for thinking a little different from me, but I also know that they can do good while I also think the way I think and also do good as well. You know, we all have different ideas. Dennis Valera joins us now. Dennis, so glad to have you here. Diversity of thought there. It's a great point at the end. I'm curious, ahead of this, uh, Arizona, Phoenix, Arizona, May 18th is when the competition begins. What are the kids doing to get ready for it? Yes, yeah, so Tony, Dana, right now they are on spring break. They're getting much needed rest right now. But when they get back into the classroom, they are going to be doing a lot of tests. They're going to be making sure that the math, the science is all right and that their uh, wind turbines are as efficient, as fast as they need to be to win at the world competition. Oh, we certainly wish them a lot of luck yeah, and a great sure story. We appreciate you bringing it to us. Dennis, thank you.